Hey guys, come check out some of these remarkable features in this kitchen we just wrapped up. I'm Paul from Contact Renovation and Custom Homes. Welcome to the Art of Renovation. So here we have a kitchen that we've fully transformed within this home. And this used to be your classic U-shaped kitchen. We did blow out the bearing wall that divided the kitchen from the dining area and from the living room. So ultimately one concern within design was how do we optimize the storage space as they're going to lose some of the wall cabinetry in the wall that's been removed. So a lot of planning went into the design of these cabinets and how they're going to function um, and also how they're going to look. So one of the more attractive details would be these floating shelves here at the end. They've got lighting incorporated into them. They still allow for a nice line of sight through into the living area. Nice spot to display some items. Looks great, really kind of adds another element of depth and richness to the kitchen design. Um, in here, they never used to have an exterior vented range hood, so it was a problem for venting in the home. So we didn't punch through the roof, added the exterior venting. Again, thinking about optimizing space, they didn't want a range hood, they needed a microwave. So they opted for this nice compact microwave range hood unit. It's a great solution for space savings, works well. You do need to give a bit more clearance there so it's not in your way when you're cooking. But if it can work great for you, it's a, it's a fantastic way to address that problem. Um, storage wise, we have some really good um, upper cabinets incorporated into the design. We have a vaulted roof here, vaulted ceiling, so lots of room for high upper cabinets above. They're good for storing those things that you don't use on a regular basis. Tucks them up out of the way and sealed, keeps everything looking nice and clean. Above the fridge, we have some nice vertical slots to store their cookie sheets and their cook, uh, cutting boards. And again, some other storage higher up for those occasional use items. Back into the sink area, we have these great incorporated drawers. You pull them out and you have access to your garbage and your recycling with space behind for storage of your cleaning supplies and different pullouts throughout to help store things like utensils and small appliances and keep them off of your uh, countertops. We have kind of a classic subway towel backsplash, some nice under cabinet lighting that gives for a nice finish on the space, some nice task lighting. For the kitchen itself, this used to have a centralized light fixture. We've now incorporated a grid of six pot lights, nice bright LED pot lights on dimmers. So you really get that great lighting when you need it. You can dim it down if you just want it for kind of accent lighting in the background. Additionally, we used to have a cupboard with some shelves in it. We've now done a built-in pantry with, with roll-out shelves or drawers, really helps to maximize the space within that pantry and squeezes out every square inch of storage uh, in, in that space. So if you have questions about designing your kitchen and how to get the most out of it, please do reach out. I'm Paul from Contact Renovations. Have a great one.